What is going on, Phantom Army? It is your boy, Phantom Stilts, and welcome back once again to Control. Hope you guys have enjoyed the series up to this point. Today, we are starting part six of the series. Hope you guys are excited. Make sure to like and subscribe. If this is your first time here. Make sure to like and subscribe. That way, you guys don't miss any new content of Control or any other gameplay series or videos on the channel. Without any further ado, let's jump back in with Jesse and see if we can find Dylan. My Brother's Keeper is the mission that we have on our plate today. So if you guys missed last episode, we actually just got the HRA running and that was our deal with Marshall. Once we got the HRA running and found the Black Rock Prism to make that work, we were going to get information about where Dylan was being held inside the Bureau of Control. So let's go ahead and look at our missions here. So what we got to do next here. So my brother's keeper, Jesse, goes to the containment sector to find the Panopticon where Dylan is held. So... If you guys did miss last episode, Marshall was talking about how Dylan was dangerous. And if you guys have been following the story since the beginning, if you haven't, I'll sort of fill you in what's going on. So Jesse and Dylan have more or less the same powers. Um, they basically are the same type of person when it comes to the telekinesis and stuff like that. They have the same powers, so they've tried to keep Dylan in this panopticon to keep him from basically tearing the entire building apart and everybody inside it. So let's go down to the containment sector and see if we can find him here. All right, so down in the containment sector. Let's see if we can find this bad boy. Sector. Panopticon. Altered items. Maximum security prison. Dangerous. All right, Trench. Let's go ahead and go up these stairs here, see if we can gain a little bit of an advantage on the high ground. We're able to. Looks like these are all offices, so we can't, we have to go back downstairs. Okay, no problem. If this guy's gonna come in this room here. Probably not, we're probably gonna have to go out and fight him. Yeah, let's get the fire extinguisher. That'll put some serious hurt on these guys. Come on, dude. Let's get a little bit of a break here. All right, took him out. We got one more guy to take care of, it looks like. Let's go ahead and pull this out here. Where's he at? Gotcha, bitch. We got one more. Yep. Come here, dude. Boom! We got some energy back. Looks like we got a material over here we can pick up. Go in the shelter, see if there's any kind of like boxes we can open. Yep, there we go. Ding! Weapon mod! Holy cool. Okay. Looks like we got Hiss over here. Let's see. 
Panopticon is straight ahead. Okay, perfect. These guys are going to drop. Shield here. Get some health back. Get our energy back. That didn't work out very well. energy bag. There we go. Took him out. Took him out. Woo! Get some health. Good God. Okay, we'll get some health back. That was intense. Now we got a control point we can cleanse. Alrighty. So let's see where we gotta go here. So if we continue on straight, we'll be headed on where we're going. An Opticon is straight ahead, perfect. The medical wing. So intense. Get away from them! Zing! Okay, we can go ahead and get our energy back here. That way we can do some more fighting. They really throw the guys at you with the shields late in this game. Come on. Energy back. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. Took him out. We got two more guys with shields. This guy's going to come over here. Take you out. We got one guy left. Where's he at? Gotcha, bish. Alrighty. Let's see. So, I'm assuming we have to go up these stairs. We don't have the key card. Gotta destroy this stuff? Yep. Alright, we'll go through here. Like zombies.
freaking hiss zombies. Oh my god. Okay, looks like we got one more that we got to deal with. He is in the other room, so let's go ahead and grab some of this health here. What's that, dude? Oh my god. Go over here. Some more space to work with. Come on, dude. Come in the door. Come on. Yeah, there's that. There's one more left, I think. Whoa! Good god, these things are powerful, man. It's It can hit me through the windows?! Wasn't expecting that. Alright. Kill it? Okay, I think I got him. Alright, let's go down here. Is there any more health I can grab? Because we are very, very low on health. Uh, let's see. Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's keep moving on here. Those things are scary, man. They're powerful. We continue on this way. Box we can open. Panopticon is up the stairs. A lot of enemies to get through, man. Holy shit. Panopticon, looks like it's to the left. Up through here. Looks like we got another light switch we gotta deal with. That was creepy. More ocean view hotel stuff. Okay, so we gotta figure out this puzzle again. That sounds fun. Okay, that's different. Um, let's see here. Okay, got the keys. Go back in the black pyramid room. Pyramid room. Hit the light switch. Alright, we're back in the bureau. It's been a long time since Dylan and I knew each other. I've wondered about him. What kind of man he'd grow up to be. Were things as hard for him as they were for me? Maybe in here, they were even harder. Speak with Panopticon Supervisor. Oh, hello. 
Is there something I can help you with? I'm Jesse, the new director. I need to get inside. New director? Right, uh, well, okay, hello, I'm Frederick Langston, the Panopticon supervisor. It's not the best time for a tour. We have hiss everywhere, numerous cell breaches, and system failures across the board, but you're the director, so here we go. Founded by Zachariah Trench, the Panopticon is our state-of-the-art repository for all altered I items. I don't have time for this. Power and I was told Dylan Faden was kept here. Can you help me find him? Faden? Uh, sure. Darling wanted him somewhere secure and isolated, away from people. He's in the maximum security cells, upper level. But there's currently a, uh, a pressing matter, ma'am. We've got an object of power loose in there, and <laughs> it's wrecking the place. The Benikoff TV? It's, uh, it's a real doozy. Salvador took a team in to handle it, but no one's heard from them for hours. This is a Category 5 OOP we're talking about, and if we don't contain it soon, it will tear the Panopticon apart. And we don't want all those altered items getting loose, ma'am. No, trust me. Dylan's in there. Open the door, Langston. I'll handle it. If you say so. Uh, I usually tell first-timers not to touch anything, so, uh, just do that. Here, I'll get the door for you. And please, ma'am, call me Fred. Thanks, Langston. Subdue the Benikoff TV object of power, fourth floor. I better okay. not be blamed for this mess in the next performance review. I am captivated. The Panopticon. Dylan's close. But that object of power might wreck this place before I find him. Ass is sizzling all over the place. All right. Let's see. Open up this. See what we got. Yeah. Yeah, these are all the altered items in the cell. Fourth floor. Something went wrong with the Bureau's plan to make Dylan the next director. Marshall made it sound like it was all Dylan's fault, but how much of it was what the Bureau did to him? I don't think she's telling me everything. Probably not. This doesn't seem like a game where everything is just put out in front of you. You sort of have to figure it out yourself. So, we got Hiss floating around. I can see one of them floating. Whoa! Okay. Guy's like following us. Okay, fourth floor. We gotta find the TV. Control point real quick. Go ahead and look at our abilities here. We want some more health. Uh, let's do... Don't want... Melee is not a huge thing for me for some reason. Let's do launch. Constructs, weapon forms, upgrade grip, upgrade spin, construct shatter, construct pierce. Pierce is precise with a charged shot that penetrates armor and enemies at any range. Shatter has high stopping power with a scatter shot that devastates grouped enemies at close range. Charge holds up to three explosive projectiles that can stagger enemies caught in their blast radius. Oh, uh, let's do... That's like a shotgun. Let's do charge. Oh, we don't have the materials for it. 
the only one that we can construct right now is Pierce. Okay. That's spin. Okay, let's go back into our menu and actually put this weapon form to good use. Um, so can we only have two weapon forms at the same time? I guess so. Okay, so we can only have two weapon forms at the same time, which is kind of weird. Not too bad, though. Okay, let's see. We got weapon mod. Health boost. Uh, let's see, 24% health boost. Health recovery and element pickup. Uh, energy recovery. Let's do a health boost. It looks like we can do another personal mod. Uh, let's see, let's do energy recovery. And we can add something to Pierce, it looks like. Weapon armor damage. Actually, let's do a second, let's do a second tier one. We can. Let's change this one to a second tier one if we can. Ammo efficiency, okay. All right, we should be good now. our weapon form here. Let's do another pure shot. Nice. Flip it around here. Oh my gosh. We're gonna need pierce for this long these long range engagements because they destroy the shield. There we go. There we go. Some more shield efficiency for a personal mod. Get these guys. Coolie cool. The object of power. I need to cleanse it. Subdue so the Benikoff TV object of power. Okay, so it looks like the Benikoff TV might be our first big boss of the game. All right. Go ahead and see if we can go after this thing. Trippy. It's like the Twilight Zone, dude. This is insane.
Alright, so this looks like the telltale sign of a boss fight. So let's go ahead and drop down here. And recharge. Salvador was the guy in the middle. Take him out. Take this guy out over here. Him out. Okay, so he's definitely going to be throwing some shade. So he's waiting for me to pop out. Where's he going? Where's he at? Looks like he's on the right side of me. Where are you at, dude? So, we got him down to almost half. God. Oh my gosh! Almost got him. Oh my gosh. Behind the pillar. Holy crap. Oh my god, he's coming for me! I'm going to try to stay behind this thing. Oh, 
Oh my god, dude, he's so close to being dead. Okay, stay behind this. Okay, he's moving. One more, like, one more shot and he's gone, dude. One more. Got him! That thing was Salvador the head. Got him! This team didn't stand a chance against the Hiss. No one here does. Alright, so now that we got Salvador taken care of... Personnel mods full. Okay. So now we gotta go cleanse the Benton Benikoff TV. Okay. The TV. Okay, so we have to use Levitate to complete the Astral Plane Challenge. Hold A to Levitate. Keep holding A to Levitate higher. Okay. Uh, looks like we have to go... We have to go over here? Oh, we fell. Okay, we have to use Levitate to complete the Astral Plane Challenge. Okay. Keep holding A to levitate higher. Nice, okay. It looks like we took care of all that. Okay, so we just continue levitating. Okay, dealt with the TV. 
Now I can find Dylan. All right, return to the Panopticon. This is where we fought Salvador. That boss battle was intense, dude. Okay. And levitate. Levitate back up here. Okay, took him out. Nice. Okay, so we took them out. Now we gotta levitate back this way. Can we do anything where we gotta go? Where do we have to go? Uh, down? So we gotta go this way. Switch for Dylan in the maximum security cells. Fifth floor. So we gotta go to the fifth floor, it looks like. Where's the elevator? Elevator, elevator. I believe it's over here. Come on, elevator. We got business to take care of. About to say, is it coming? Oh, maybe we have to levitate up to the fifth floor. Maybe that's why. Okay. That's probably why we learned that power. Alright, so let's go back out into the Panopticon. Yeah, it looks like we have to levitate off or over here. Search for Dylan in the maximum security cells. Okay. Fifth floor. Okay, here's the fifth floor. Whoa! Hello. 
Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, Emily. Holy crap, he like destroyed this place. Are you there, Jesse? Emily? He's gone, Dylan isn't here. He might be nearby. Or maybe the hiss got to him. I don't know. Jesse, listen. Dylan's here. With us. He just walked in. He says he is giving himself up. He's been affected by the hiss, but, but he is different than the others. We must isolate him. I'm on my way. <laughs> 